Hi everybody, it's Kathy and I'm back with another Dollar Tree haul. Uh, I have a pretty good size haul here for you guys and uh, I also wanted to let you know that that friend mail that I didn't open yesterday, I am not going to open because I just realized that it's um, my pocket letter exchange with Lisa from Texas and I don't want to open it until I get mine out in the mail. So, sorry Lisa, I want to make sure you get mine before I open yours. But thank you so much. I can't wait to see it. All right, guys, let's get started with this haul. Um, I got a lot of hodgepodge. I got some craft stuff. Let me just start here with this box. Had to pick this up. Look at the car with the little heart on the top and the hearts coming out the back. And this side has got the red, the pink truck with the hearts in the back and it says happy valentine's day and i showed you guys these boxes before they're cardboard this has got the car and the truck on the side both sides and just well i can't really see inside but it's red inside and i just use this for decor i just thought it was really cute loved that truck um I, like i said before i don't do a whole lot of valentine's decorating um, even though I've probably shown you five or six things that I picked up already for Valentine's decor, but anyway, I picked that up. Um, there's a couple sizes on that. I think that one was the biggest one. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Picked up some pretty napkins. I got these. They're the dinner napkins. Uh, they're 16 in a pack and I picked up two of them for when I have friends over. 16 as you can see in the pack this my new Dollar Tree the one here in Cohoes has got these fancy napkins now um, all my other stores around here don't carry them I also picked up these little pretty butterfly napkins these are luncheon napkins and you get 18 of these I think they're probably kind of skinny because this has only got 16 and this has got 18 and look at the difference so anyway, they're pretty. They're really for, you know, decoration, not really for napkin, you know, just for a little of the mouth. Um, next, <laughs> next thing I picked up was I picked up another package of these storage bags. I told you guys all about these. I love them. I'm not going to go on and on about them. If you're new to my channel, these are really great. The zip on them is fantastic, and I highly recommend them. My store only had the extra large one, um, extra large size. I really like the extra, extra large because they're really big. Um, but I did pick up another box of these. Um, I had to, you guys know me and my plastic containers. Love this weave um, look. And this is this teal color is new to me. I really like these a lot. They're pretty good size. Um, they might be deceiving on camera. Wait a minute. I think I put my ruler here. I did. Wow. These are six inches tall. And end to end, they are uh, almost 11 inches. So 11 inches this way, six inches that way. But I just love this teal color. Thought it was so pretty. I love when they come out with new colors on these and they're great for storage. They're sturdier than some of the other. Um, the weave uh, makes them a little sturdier than the other containers that they have. So that's that. Uh, I had to pick this up. I saw it. I was like, oh my God, look it. It's a caddy corn. It's a um, luggage tag it, and it's a caddy corn. Look at him, isn't he sweet? I picked up one for my friend Linda as well because I just knew that she would love this little caddy corn. He's so cute. Isn't he adorable? And they're rubber and they have the little thing on the back where you put your name and address. But look at how stinking cute he is. They had a few other ones that were cute, um, but I need another luggage tag like I need a hole in the head. I say that often, don't I? Anyway, I found these new uh, concealer uh, sponges. They are by Sassy and Chic, and I picked these up. I've ha I got a ton of makeup brushes, but what I like on these is it's a little sponge on the end. 
which I have not seen on any of the makeup brushes at Dollar Tree. So I thought the pattern was cute and I picked up two of them. So I really thought those were nice. They had brushes, they had a bigger brush, they had a, you know, a brush like this size with, you know, bristles on the end. But I thought these uh, sponges were gonna be really nice since I wear concealer every day to cover the circles under my eyes. Um, I'm kind of all over the place here, but picked up a pack of placards. I already had to get into them because I had that um, little plastic, uh, Dollar Tree had the uh, little plastic box that you could carry your placards in, in your purse. And uh, mine was empty, so I needed to refill. Now watch the number of placards that you're getting when you buy these. My store had this package, which had 60, and then the other package had, I think, 35 or 38, and I was like, well, if I'm gonna pay a dollar, why would I pay a dollar for 38 when I could get 60? So anyway, watch your size, uh, number of pieces in your packages when you buy them, because if you see multiples, they may not be, um, you know, the same size. So I grabbed those. You know I had to get these. You know I had to get these. I saw them and I was like, I need another pair of socks like I don't know what. But they're flamingos. They're flamingos and they're crew socks, as you can see in the back. These are women's size 5 to 9, and I absolutely adore them. Gotta love them. And they're like fuzzy on the eye area. So cute. And then I just picked up a plain pair of plain white, um, like athletic socks, ultra light, low cut socks. Um, and they're like cushiony on the bottom. I've noticed that I have all these different, uh, socks and socks and socks, but I don't have any just plain white socks. So I grabbed these. Very nice. You can't beat the Dollar Tree socks. I mean, come on guys. I got two pair for a dollar. 50 cents a piece. I picked up this uh, frame, 4x6 frame. I actually picked up five of these. I only have two here now. Um, when my friends and I went to the Berkshires, uh, we got a group photo of us um, at the pool when we were all feeling our oats. And it turned out to be a really nice picture of us all. And uh, so I had it printed out and for all the people that are in there, I got a frame and I'm gonna give all of my friends one picture, one copy of that picture in a frame. Anyway, long story for uh, a couple of picture frames. These I saw, which I hadn't seen anybody haul before. They have these in metal, but they're those, um, they got the magnet on the back and it's clear on the front. And this one's like a pinky peach and it's just like a container. I thought these were really cool. I got this peach color one and then I got this teal color one. And they're see-through on the top so if you put something inside them you can see what's in them. But they also have, there goes one, they also have magnets on the back so you could hang these on your refrigerator if you wanted or on your mag, uh, cabinet at work or whatever, something metal, you can attach these. Ooh, they attach to each other too. But I thought they were really cute. They're plastic, but I thought they were pretty and I thought I could make use of those in my future craft room that I have to make. Got all my stuff down there. It's just when the weather gets nicer, I'm gonna get everything settled. When things settle down, I'm gonna do some organizing. I grabbed this birthday bag. I just thought it was so stinking cute. Every day I was working, I was seeing it and I was like, I gotta have that bag. Look at the fox and the raccoon and the rabbit and the owl. Just so stinking cute. I had to get it. I'm sure I can use it for someone's birthday. Madeline and Jordan both have birthdays coming up. And then it's got balloons and a tree on the side. Oh, and it's got little mushroom cupcakes down there so cute so so cute so I grabbed that you know you can't beat the Dollar Tree bags the party bags gift bags whatever 
for a dollar. You go anywhere else, you're paying three, four, five, even more for a gift bag. And all they're going to do is pull out what you gave them and put it aside and for a buck. They can, if they like it, they can fold it up and keep it and use, pass it along. Picked up some uh, bubble wrap to do some mailing. I have some things I got to get out in the mail. Picked up some Bullseye uh, Everyday Original Barbecue Sauce. It is 17 and a half ounces and I needed barbecue sauce. I didn't have any. I was like, how do I not have barbecue sauce? Anyway, grab that. I picked up these uh, doo -doo -doo, Paw Patrol Honey Graham Cookies. There are four packs in here. They have little shapes on them with the dog paw prints on them. Got these for Caroline. She was with me in the store, okay? So let me just tell you all these things that I got. A lot of it is Caroline. We also happened to pass the breakfast mini bites, which I tried to pass. And I said, oh, those are breakfast mini bites. You don't need those. You got the other ones. I want those. I want those. I want those. So she got them. These are blueberry flavored and uh, no artificial ingredients and they're Paw Patrol and she likes them so I got them. So there are two different ones. One's graham crackers and I'm not really sure. These kind of look like a, a cracker too but anyway. One's blueberry and one's uh, honey graham. Got those for Caroline when she's here at Grandma's. Picked up some taco seasoning mix by Old El Paso um, for a dollar. Can't beat it. I think I'm going to make some tacos this weekend. See, I showed you that. All right, I was a little hungry when I was there. So I grabbed myself a red truck. Happy Heart Day Valentine candy box. Comes with five pieces of chocolate. And this is by doo -doo -doo, Elmer Chocolates. I just like the picture. I thought I could uh, repurpose this cover. So that and I can eat the chocolates. So I've got that. I got a pack of mini Milky Ways. This is a three ounce package. So I grabbed those. I got myself some 100 grand bars, fun size. You get six in a package. I love these. These are like one, one of my favorite candies. I got uh, some Raisinets, another one of my favorites. Can't be, they have these in dark chocolate now. I haven't tried them. I like milk chocolate. So I got another box of those. I think that was all my candy. Uh, let's see here, guys. I picked up these little bunny clips. They're basically a painted or colored, um, you know what that is, clothespin with a little bunny on the top with a little tail and it's polka dot in the front. And I just thought they were too cute to pass up. So I got two packs of those. There's four in a pack, two purple, two blue. I haven't seen anybody haul this. But then again, I haven't been watching a lot of hauls. Um, like I said, time is uh, of the essence lately and uh, just doing what I can. I'm glad to have you guys back and I hope you're glad to see me. And I'm hope, I hope I'm showing you something new. Uh, I picked up two packs of this nine foot ribbon. It's the... Um, Burlap with the red hearts. Wow, so much glare. So, so much glare. Ah, there we go. A little bit better. But I thought these were so pretty. You can use them for all kinds of things. It doesn't have to just be Valentine's Day. So I grabbed two rolls of that. And I grabbed one roll of the red plaid. Reminds me of a picnic blanket. Grabbed one of those. This is also nine foot. Uh, hey, let's, let me go with the craft stuff. I picked up these beads. They're glass beads, but they look like pearls. You get little mini bitty beads, middle size bead, and a bigger bead. These are all smaller than the beads that I got 
earlier and there are approximately 135 pieces in there. So I grabbed two. Not that I need 270 beads, but they were only a dollar by Crafter Square and you never know what I might do with these. So if you guys want these, Cahoe's store, they are available. Hopefully, if, it, if they haven't been all bought out. This one lady went through my line yesterday, and she had these thick wooden hearts on a, on a, um, a string. They were probably this thick. They were really nice. And I was like, oh, man, I didn't see these. She goes, oh, well, they're all gone now. I bought them all. So that's how that works. If you see it, grab it, because you don't know, you know who's going to come along and buy all of it. Picked up some foam conversation hearts. There are 90 pieces in here. These are great for pocket letters. So they say, be mine, cool kid, love you, sweetheart, XOXO. And they're all different colors, just like the little candies, which I think are disgusting, personally. I never liked them as a kid. Ugh. I also picked up these foam stickers all different shapes and they are pink and white and red foam stickers you get a hundred of these also great for um, pocket letters or decorating cards or any number of things picked up two more packs of these um to do, do sacks treat sacks they're burlap I don't know if they're real real burlap or not, but I got them in the pink and I got them in the red. I opened these up for you last time if you want to see them up close. I opened the pink ones last time. For those of you that did not watch my last video, I will open up the red ones just to show you. And for those who were here, aren't they just adorable? Aren't they just adorable? And you could, you know, put, uh, personalize them by putting something on the um, heart there. And they are just too stinking cute. So I got one more pack of each because I don't know when I'll see those again. And when I do decide to craft, I might not have enough. And you get, oh, you only get three? You get three in each package. I thought you got four, but okay, three's good. Uh, I grabbed some new stickers. These are so stinking cute. I bought two packs of them. Look at these stickers, all right? Look at the cat with the glasses and the french fries and the little fox and the banana and the rainbow and there's the kitty with the glasses again. They are just too stinking cute. I can't stand it. I don't have anything to put behind it. Do do do. Nope, sorry. I hope you can see them as they are. I bought two packs of them because I just thought they are too stinking cute, and when I use them and they're gone, I'm going to be so sad. So I bought two packs. You get 35 stickers in each package, and they're all pretty good size, so it's not like you get, you know, five or six. Oh, look at the flamingo. I didn't even see him. Look it. And the hot dog with the face on it. I can't stand it. Too cute. Too, too cute. And the little, <laughs> the little uh, cactus. With the face on it. Too cute. So I grabbed those stickers. I picked up another package of these red gems. Uh, gemstone stickers. 315 you get of these. These are great for pocket letters and whatnot. I also picked up these stickers. Look at the cat with the sunglasses again. And the dog. And the pineapple. And this other little dog. What's this thing in the middle? Oh, koala. It's hard to see because he's shiny. There he is. Oh, and when pigs fly. So cute. And then a little sloth. The reflection is really something to be seen. Anyway, I got those. I picked up, this is an 11 count. I picked up these beautiful stickers. Love them. Love cactus. This one says today, and this one says good times, and this little thing says live. And I like this little round one up here. So pretty. Grab that. 
Uh, I picked up a couple of stencils. I thought these butterflies are really pretty. You could stencil them on anything and just really make something nice with those. So I got those. And then I got these for Madeline. I want to make her something for her birthday. And unicorn, unicorn stencils. Can't stand it. <coughs> so I grabbed those. All right. Let me finish my craft stuff and then I'll show you the stuff I got, Caroline. Picked up another package of these speckled eggs in the container. Just like an egg container. It's got the little raffia tied around it and they're too stinking cute. You get six eggs, all different colors. So I had to get another one of those. Um, I was thinking about making some floral things. So I picked up two... Uh, Styrofoams in the green. These are 2.9 by 3.9 by 3.9. So I grabbed those. So it's 2.9 this way, 3.9 square. So grab two of those for more crafting. Um, I found some in my store. I haven't seen these in my stores. Uh, they are willow wreaths. Does it say how big this one is? This one is nine inches in diameter. Thought I could make something nice with that. And then they had a bigger one. This one is 12 inches. 12 inches in diameter. So two sizes. You could make a snowman out of these. You could, uh, I don't know, make earrings out of these. You could put them on your face. I don't know. I'm just being silly. Okay, now let's... I was wanted to do this with Caroline so she could show you what she got. But she was here this weekend, and with the Super Bowl and everything, we just didn't have time to record. And she's been bugging me about this one thing that I got her. She keeps saying, you got me that. It's at your house. And I said, yes, yes, it is, honey. But I want to show my subscribers what I got you before I give it to you. So next time you come over, you can have it. And that would be this. Princess Jasmine, paint your own. Uh, comes with five colors. And she named them all off. She was like, purple, teal, yellow, orange, pink. I was like, teal? How does she know teal? Watch your grandma too much. Uh, paint your own artboard set. So it comes with one jasmine. She's so pretty. I love her. And then the paints and the brush. Caroline loves doing painting, coloring with markers, drawing, coloring with, uh, drawing with crayons. And so she said, Grandma, you have to have something too. So Grandma picked up the unicorn with the markers. And this is a poster. There are two posters in here. Let's open it up and see what's in it. Did I have my scissors here? No, of course I don't. Of course I don't. So these are posters. Let's see what they look like. I believe they're, oh yeah, they're felt. They are felt. And there is this one, really pretty. And I got this one. So really, really pretty. It's got its own color on it, and then you can paint the flowers around it. Or not paint, but it's got the uh, markers. I like when she uses markers better than when she uses paints, because paints kind of get all over the place. But this is really pretty, this other one, too. So you get two of them. Let me show them both to you at the same time. Very nice with the markers. So we will have a little bit of crafting time. And then I got her this bag of stuff. Oh, I had to get her this. I say get her this. I got me this to sharpen her colored pencils with. Look at it. It's a, it's a cat mermaid. Too freaking cute. And it's a pencil sharpener. Hopefully it sharpens the pencils. I don't know. I just thought it was too cute. There are four of them. I thought the sloth one was cute too. And what's this one? Uh, I don't know what that is. And then there's a unicorn, but I just love the cat. I had to get it. All right, we are going long. I am going to go quick through all this stuff I got, Caroline. 
she did not hurt for anything. I got her this squeezy French fries, which when we got to the counter, she was like, Grandma, I don't want those French fries. I was like, uh, you're getting them. <laughs> I got them mostly for me because I thought they were too stinking cute. Look at the little face with the thumbs up. And I love French fries and I love squishies. So that's all I can say about that. I said they're for her, but they're really for me. But I found these new Barbie things um, in my store. And they're little Barbie figurines. Okay? This one is... These are Be Anything You Can Be Barbies. This is the baseball playing Barbie. I got them all for All the ones they had. I got the Pop Star Barbie. I got the Astronaut Barbie. And I'm pretty sure they were wiped out from my store when I went back the next day to see if there was more. I got the Soccer Player Barbie. What else is in here? And I got the Ballerina Barbie. So these are really cute. They're Barbie brand. You can't get this stuff for a dollar anywhere but the Dollar Tree. And let's see, there's one, two, three, five of them. So there's Ballerina, Pop Star, Soccer Player. I don't think I can hold them all. Baseball. So if, if you have a little girl that's into any of these things and the... Um, astronaut so that's all of the barbie ones that i got for her so you know got all those and then we saw muppet babies there's fozzy bear and there are six of them i didn't get them all because they didn't have them all i did get this one which is summer they had him her her I see the ponytail on the top, but it could be a man bun. I don't know. So I got Fozzie and I got Summer and I got Gonzo. I love Gonzo. I love him. He's great. So the only ones I didn't get were Kermit, Miss Piggy, and Animal, which hopefully I will find at some point, but love these Love, love, love them. Caroline doesn't really know who they are, but when I tell her, she'll love them. And that's all there is to that. And then she got Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse. She loves to play with her little figurines. So, you know, I got these so she can play with these. And these have Minnie Mouse, three different Mickey Mouses, a Pluto, and a Donald. As you can see, Mickey gets center stage. There's running Mickey. There's standing Mickey. There's hearing Mickey. And I was going to grab another Mickey last night when I was at work, but I didn't know which one I had got. I thought I got this one, but so I didn't grab it. And the, there was only one Minnie, so I got that. I didn't see Donald, and I didn't see Pluto. But if you guys see these, you should grab them. If you love Disney characters, Mickey and Minnie. So that, my friends, is my Dollar Tree haul. I'm so sorry it's 28 minutes. I don't know how I got carried away with that. I told you it was lots of stuff. Um, I hope you're all having a great night. I don't want to waste any more of your time because I got nothing more to show you. I do have more to show you, but it's in another haul. Anyway, it's... Tuesday night. I hope you all are having a great week. Uh, I don't work again till Friday, so I have a couple more days to go back to my Dollar Tree and see what's new. Uh, I hope you head out to your Dollar Tree and find out what I, what's out there. There's some really good stuff out there. I'm hoping to find some new things uh, for a friend. My friend Tony asked me to pick up a few things, and that's in my next haul, which I'll show you. And uh, I'm going to let you guys go. I hope you're having a good week, and I will see you in my next Dollar Tree haul. If you're new, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell button. You'll be advised every time I upload a video. Bye, guys.